So I'm Emily. I am a senior in the ECE department studying electrical engineering. Um, I'll be graduating in a couple weeks, which is really exciting. So the 2 plus 2 program is basically NC State has set up um, a partnership with um, both different, uh, a couple of their state universities, so um, UNC Asheville and UNCW. Um, basically, you take um, kind of your core classes, your calculus, your physics, um, in the first two years at your chosen place, so either Asheville, Wilmington, whichever place you end up. And then from there, you um, apply straight to a department here at NC State. Um, I applied here to the ECE department, and uh, you then can finish your degree. Um, your credits for all of the, the prereq stuff will transfer. You finish your degree here, and then you'll have a degree from NC State. I, um, I did robotics in high school. My grandfather was an electrical engineer, and I knew engineering was something that I really, really liked. Um, the way the cards fell, I ended up down in Wilmington at UNCW um, studying biology and I, because I loved it and I thought that's what I wanted to do. Um, I got to junior year in my biology degree and I said, oh no, I really miss engineering. <laughs> um, so I then started talking to, NC State basically has a, an advisor um, at all of their two plus two institutions. Um, so I talked to Dr. Reamer, um, who is the advisor down in Wilmington. And she kind of helped me get on the track to where I had taken a couple calculuses for my biology degree, but I went ahead and like and took the rest of the math classes, the physics classes, all of that stuff. Um, and then my senior year, while also doing my biology degree, I was applying um, to transfer to NC State um, to to complete a secondary degree here in the ECE department. The transition was, I mean, it wasn't rainbows and butterflies, that's for sure. Um, but it also was as easy as it could be just because I was immediately put into kind of a smaller class setting than you would be as a freshman. So you're immediately in those um, ECE classes where you're they're still larger, but you're pared down significantly from taking like a physics class um, in one of the big lecture halls on main campus. I kind of settled into pace pretty easily, um, pretty quickly, just because when you're around people that are in your major, you're a lot more comfortable to like hang out and talk to people and really get to know a bunch of people because those are the people that are going to be with you for the remainder of the time that you're there. At the university. I would recommend the 2 plus 2 program for somebody who isn't super sure what they want to do um, as well as for somebody that honestly in my case didn't get into state the first time. Um, I It was hard and devastating and it really sucked but at the same time if I had known about the 2 plus 2 program going in, I would have felt a lot better about what I was doing um, and where I was going, but I kind of took the long road to find the 2 plus 2 program. Um, but I recommend the 2 plus 2 program to somebody who isn't quite sure, um, might be from the Raleigh area, and just kind of wants to get away for a little bit. Um, I know when I graduated high school, I was like, okay, peace, I'm ready to go. Like. Um, Wilmington wasn't super far away from my home, but it was just far enough that um, I didn't feel the need to go home every weekend, um, which was really nice and it kind of helped me become a kind of more independent person. Personally, um, I took the long road, but it also kind of helped me realize that there are many paths to get to the same destination, which is really something I had a very in high school, I had a very distinctive path of this is what I want to do. This is how I'm going to do it. This is the four things that I need to do to get there. And when that all kind of fell apart, um, I kind of had to learn and figure out what, what I needed to do next to really 
get to where I truly wanted to be and how to make it work.